All right, so guys, if you are interested in downgrading iPhone 5 or 5S, here is the video for you. Lead down has been updated to version 2.2, which has added support for A6 devices also. Previously, it supported A7 devices. Now, it also supports M1 Max on any version of Mac OS. You can use this software to downgrade to 8.4.1 on iPhone 5 or 10.3.3 on iPhone 5s. I have the full guide attached in the description in the pinned comment and in the card above. Now guys, if you want to downgrade A5 devices, their support was cancelled on this software because Checkmate exploit was not working reliably. But I have an alternative guide in the pinned comment and in the description that allows you to downgrade A5 devices to 8.4.1, meaning iPad mini 1 and so on. Now let's check out the official website for lead down. Here is the official website for lead down software. You can download the latest version from right here. Here are the compatible devices iPhone 5, iPad 4, iPhone 5s, iPad mini 2 and iPad Air 1. As I said it requires Mac OS 7.0 on M1 or 10.1.3 on Intel Max. Now let's see how this app looks like. I will download the latest version. It is almost done. Download and open this DMG. Now simply drag lead down to your applications folder. Open applications. Open lead down. If you see this dialog just click on open. All right guys this is how this app looks like. Now simply connect a compatible device in DFU mode such as an A6 or a 7 device and it will start the downgrade process. It does not need any SHSH blobs. It uses OTA downgrade method. If you want to see it in full action, the guide is in the description and in the pinned comment. That's all for this video guys. If you still have questions, you can always ask in the comment section and I will reply you as soon. I will see you in a new video. Goodbye.